board certified behavioral analyst, Jane Paul, discuss how she felt stigma of disability has kept some African American families from accepting a diagnosis or accessing treatment for their children. Jane, how have you seen stigma of a disability keep families from getting a diagnosis? Stigma brings with it shame, embarrassment, isolation. All of a sudden you feel like once you have this child with this diagnosis, you feel like you don't belong in that community anymore. And that affects everything about you as a parent. So it does affect and it affect everything about you know looking for services. Jane, can you tell a story of a family that you worked with in the past that had a child with a developmental disability and got the diagnosis but wasn't ready to make the necessary changes to become an intervention partner? I had a parent that I can, you know, vividly remember. And this parent was, um, he, she did not really accept the diagnosis and she was not ready to participate in program. And that is the family that we had to meet where she was so that we can start a journey that was going to change her life and the life of the rest of her family. And that particular mom actually said, you know what, you are the professional, you do your job. I am with this child 24 hours. These three hours that you are here, that's my me time. So I don't want to know what you are doing. You do your job, let me know when you're done, I'll sign the papers. And I say, you know what, that would be really good, but it will not work. Because what happens, if you do not know what we are doing, you will not do anything afterwards. The, the behaviors that you're dealing with in the home, if you do not know how we are actually working to make sure that they don't happen after we leave, you are going to do the same, same old things that you have been doing. And guess what? You will always have services in the home. And I always tell them, my job is to make you me, is to make you fire me from my job in your family. We will 